Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. And today I am opening the Sew Bomb DIY um, Aroma Bath Bomb um, Factory. And yeah, I'm so excited. Um, and yes, yeah, so. Oh, also, Happy New Year because it is New Year's Day. Um, so I've opened the box. And like it's actually quite good because it's like flappy. Um, trying to put my phone up. Wait. Okay, there we go. So we've got. Let me get the instructions. Oh, got the instructions plus some more things in here. Where are my scissors? Some oh there you go. Okay. Just gonna pop right into there. Doesn't matter where. Oh, so we got some very cute little mould. Oh that's cute. Well I don't know actually. I think that's a mould. It looks like a mould. But I don't know because I think you're supposed to have like a pot for a mould. Right. We've got some, oh my god, we've got some crystals, we have some white clear ones, we have some pink, we have some turquoise, my favourite colour, and we have some yellow. Um, and then we also have a lovely little spoon as well, that's actually quite nice. But yes, yeah, so, oh my god, we have stickers, I love stickers so much. Um, okay, so, oh, that's good. So it shows you, like, what, it's like a little, like, thing. So there's relax, zen, happiness, focus, vi vitality, vitality, or oh, energize. So, like, here, there's little, like, little, like, sensors and stuff like that you can put into it. Oh, I like that, that's cute. And then we also obviously have the instructions. Um, this this is, it comes in lots of different like languages. So it's just showing you like how to make stuff, like make the bath bombs. Is there anything on the other side? So here we have the base, and I really love this base. Okay, so now it says, once the 13 minutes have eclipsed, remove the tab and slowly open the mould and check that the surface of your bath bomb is completely dry. If your ball is still wet or soft when, you, when you're pressing, close your the mould and let it dry again. It's up to you to decide the texture of your bath bomb. The longer you wait, the fizzy effect will be a problem. I don't know how you say that, but I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Okay, right. How do I? Oh, yeah. You slide it off. Okay, guys, let's see. Oh, no, this isn't going to work. It just went completely in half, guys. Oh, I am not happy about that. 
I'll try again and I'll see you in a minute. Um, so it's like really nice. It's got little bubbles. Um, it's, it's got like little pots, like a big circle. So I think something goes in there. We also have this like little pot. Oh, and this, this looks like it well, should be going. Oh, there we go. That's cool. That's a cool little like thing. Oh yeah, so now I can fix that in. Now, oh, I don't know what that's for. I think I'll figure that out soon. Oh, we have all the powders. Oh my gosh. Right. Just need to open this. Oh. We have this. This isn't the best part. I think this goes on. I think it goes on here. Does it? Oh, there we go. Got a little. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Oh no. I don't know. I'll figure that out. Then we also have these. Oh my god, we have these little sensors. I don't know what this is. Oh, this is like a little spinny thing, I think. So, like, spin it around. I'll figure that out soon. We also, oh, we have another little bug. Oh no, it's not another little bug. We have a lavender scent. I'm gonna smell that. Oh, that smells so nice. I wish you could smell on camera because that does really smell nice. We have, oh, we have some little cup things. Two of them. And then we also have orange, we have rose, and what is, what is this? Oh my goodness. We have, okay, this is kind of weird. I think this is the mould, but I don't know. I don't know. We have these little weird things. And then we also... Oh, no, we don't. Do we? No, we don't. I thought we had gloves then, but... Oh, I think this is the mould. I'm going to just open all the other um, bags, and then I'll see you in a minute. Okay, guys, so now I've unboxed, like, everything. And now it's time to do some stickers. So I'm going to do this one. This one goes on this base thing. Then we've got a room spa. I'm not that good at doing stickers. I have to be honest. Yeah. goes there we go and then I've got oh very cute little things there and then the last sticker goes on here I'm really sorry about that light it's been really annoying but they go in Now, oh god, comes the scary part, but also the very exciting part. So, now it's time to make 
Oh my goodness, I am scared. There we go. Right. So it says, take the aroma guide and choose the recipe you want to make according to your mood. Okay. I don't know. I'm. I want to do energize because today I went on a walk to energize. Pour the sodium bicarbonated vat in completely into your factory. So I have to pour it into here. So I don't know if you have to. Choose the ex the colour, but 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 I'm gonna I'm gonna I think I'm gonna do this this um, green one because I feel like it's more energized i'm going to take my watch off because i don't want to mess um ruin that just in case i don't even know if it will ruin it but just in case because that's the one that i got for christmas so right this is so okay pouring it all in I really want to use this bath bomb tomorrow. I only had a bath last night, so I should have really thought, but I didn't even know I was going to be making it. So, then it use, then it says, choose an ambience perfume and pour 10 drops over the powder. So it says lavender, rose, or orange. It says energize is rose. Um, but I want to smell rose because I don't. Because for some reason I feel like rose will be strong. Oh wait, that's actually not too bad. I don't know. Let me smell orange. I don't. I'm not really a fan of orange. It's not too bad that smell actually. I think I'm gonna do lavender because it's purple. Yeah, I do really like that. So it says 10 drops, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay. Yay! So I've just finished um, mixing. Then it says, then take the citric acid bag and press to reduce the lumps and pour it all the way inside. So this is citric acid. Just in case. Then it says, close the plant. Plant, I don't know. Tilt the mi and mix until no lumps or until the two powders are well mixed. So, I'm going to go and put this on. And, yeah. Oh, I'm just going to stir, and stir, and stir, and stir, and carry on tilting. I want to see if that actually does anything. 
Uh, but yeah, and I'll see you in a minute. Okay, so now it says, close the lid, then tilt the globe to mix your powder. I don't get that. Turn the crank to mix. Continue until there is no more lumps in the powder. Okay. Okay. And then it says tilt. I know what it means. Why won't you do it? I don't know if it means to talk back. Ow. Okay, there we go. Okay, that's not that easy. Oh, there we go. Okay, now I'm just going to mix this and I'll see you in a minute. And now... Um, I've finished mixing and now it says pour the salt crystals me, um, into the bottom of the mould before adding the powder. So, um, I don't know if I should, I think I might go for pink. Because, because, I think pink and blue look nice. But they're not actually fully pink, they're like pinky purple. So I'm just going to make a small hole and add some in. Not too many though. Okay, I think that'll be enough. Then it says straighten and open your factory. Then use your spoon to pour the powder into the mould. Okay, so I think it means this spoon. So, okay. I don't know how much you need. I think this will probably make two by the size of it looking. But you do compact it down, so I don't know. Put a bit more in. Oh, just spilt some. Fine, I'll clean it up in a minute. Okay. Then it says, choose one of the handles to finish your bath bomb. Take the flat mould if you want to make a half bath bomb. Or take the half Sophia handle if you want to make a full one. Then press the powder with the handle and remove it when it's finished. Okay, so... There's either this one or this one, but obviously I have to do that. I think I'm going to make a full one, so if you guys... Oh no, I'll see you around. Okay. Okay, I, I think I need, a, need more in because that didn't do anything. Let me just try that. Okay, that's really good. But I still need more. There we go. I think this will be enough. Nope. Oh my god, I'm just not doing it right. 
comment down below if you know how to properly work it. Oh, there we go. Okay, I don't know. Okay. When it says, let the bath bomb dry to dry inside your mould without the handle on top for 30 minutes. The drying time, time verifies depending varies on depending the humidity of the hair. It is quite warm, so I'm gonna leave it to dry for a bit, even though it's dry. I know, and I'll see you in a minute. Okay, guys, I'm really happy because basically, um, I left it for another thirty minutes. I, I actually, ha I actually had to put all of it in, and yeah, I competed compacted it down and stuff um but now i'm gonna open it open it up <gasps> okay i want to make sure it doesn't fall and break but <gasps> oh my goodness this is so cool okay it's a little bit damaged at the up. Um, but it says if there are holes in the top of your ball do not hesitate to add powder and repeat the previous step I don't know what does it say I don't know but it's a bit, yeah. But I've done it now, so it's good. I do like it. It's my first one because I've never made bath bombs like this before, but I do really love it. I'm really happy, um, and yeah, I just think it's. I'm definitely using it tomorrow for a bath. I might even use it tonight, but I did have one to last night, so, you know. Thanks. So, yeah, um, thanks, everyone, for watching. Hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and if you, like, want some more, like, me playing with things or, like, opening some, like, unboxing stuff I don't know I have got a let's glow studio that I could do a YouTube video on but yeah so comment down below if you want a video on that uh, and yeah so um, make sure you turn on notifications like comment add subscribe um, and yeah so thanks for watching bye